Hey fellow traders, today I'm back with a new video and in today's video, I'm going to talk about equal distance channel. Okay, so if you are currently using trend lines and not using equal distance channel, then you want to make sure you watch this video. Okay, because equal distance channel are more powerful than trend lines. Okay, if you know you have been getting good results with uh, trading a trend line or a breakout and retest of a trend line, then you want to pay more attention to the equal distance channel because it's more powerful, it's more potent. Okay, so in today's video, I'm going to break it up into three parts. Okay, number one, I'm going to share with you why it's more powerful. I don't just want to tell you uh, why, it, I don't just want to say that it's more powerful, but I want to give you the psychology behind why it is more powerful. I want you to understand the concept. Okay, I'll talk about uh, the power of symmetry in trading. Okay. Number two, I'll talk about a step-by-step -step guide okay, to use the equidistance channel because I don't just want to tell you that uh, it's powerful. I don't just want to share with you uh, why it's powerful, but I want to show you uh, exactly how you can do it okay? because I don't want you to assume that uh, you just use the equidistance channel. I want to make sure that uh, you apply it correctly. Okay? You don't just watch any other YouTube videos and you apply it wrongly right? because if you apply it wrongly, then uh, it doesn't help. Okay, you want to, there's a correct way to apply it and there's a wrong way to apply it. So in this video, I'm going to show you exactly how you can apply this equal distance channel into your trading. Okay, and the last thing I want to go through is I want to talk about uh, what do you use it for, right? There's no point in telling you it's powerful and showing you how to use it, but don't actually show you uh, what can you use it for, okay? This part is ra rather straightforward. Uh, as you go through step one and step two, you naturally understand uh, how to use it, but I'll still cover it uh, in detail, okay? So without further ado, let's go to point one. Why is it more powerful and the power of symmetry? Just a moment. Sorry, just a little bit under the weather, down with flu, but uh, let's talk about uh, point number one. Why is it more powerful? Okay, uh, equal distance channel, it's actually drawn something like this. Let me just uh, show it to you. Uh, let me see where is the... Okay, I have it here. Okay, it's something like this. Okay, something like this. So basically, uh, you are just measuring... Uh, the You're drawing a trend line and projecting it down. Okay, versus just a normal trend line, which is a single line. Okay, so uh, if... You know, you do not really understand what equal distance channel is. It's just basically uh, you plot you plot two swing highs or you plot two swing lows and then it just it allows you to shift up and shift down, okay? So basically, the distance between this point and this point is the same. The distance between this point to this point is the same, right? Hence the name equal distance channel, okay? It is powerful because the market loves symmetry. Is that straightforward, okay? If you think about it, uh, basic chart patterns that a lot of traders know. Okay, if you are new, you do not know chart patterns, uh, make sure to check out our other videos or you know, uh, download our day trading guide because uh, we do talk about our chart patterns. So why, is, why does double bottom work? Because the market loves symmetry, right? The left and the right is the same, right? That's the, uh, that's the uh, basis of a double bottom pattern. Same for double top. Right, let me just uh, find you one over here. Double top, okay? Because the market loves symmetry, okay? If there's one thing you need to take away from this video is that uh, the market really loves symmetry. So humans are designed such that the left equals to the right, okay? So in an ideal scenario, right, the, le the left, the first top and the second top is the same. Uh, the first bottom and second bottom is about the same, okay? Even in a, uh, you know, reversal pattern like uh, the, the inverted head and shoulders or the head and shoulders, Ideally, you always see symmetry, right? Let me see if I can uh, find some for you. So over here, you can see uh, this is the left shoulder. This is the head and this is the right shoulder. You can see that it's almost the same level, right? Because the market loves symmetry. So this is a very important point. Okay, let me find you uh, one more. If I can find you uh, one more pattern. Okay, so you can see over here again, uh, this is the left shoulder. Uh, this the head and uh, this the right shoulder okay uh, if you're new to trading and you know you do not identify these patterns uh, make sure you hit a subscribe button and watch our other videos because uh, we do teach uh, this kind of concepts uh, it's pretty uh, I won't go into it in this video because uh, it can get very long but uh, in this video I just want to explain to you that 
a lot of chart patterns are based on uh, symmetry, right? Your double top, your double bottom, your head and shoulders, your inverted head and shoulders. These are all based on symmetry, right? And that's why when you do equal distance channel, where there is symmetry, right? Uh, the, the distance between, uh, as I said, the difference between uh, two points is always the same, okay? The distance is always the same. If you just take a, you know, a box to measure it, it's always the same, okay? It's always the same. That's the power of an equal distance channel. Right, the distance is always the same. So there is symmetry, right? And when there's symmetry, you want to pay more attention to it, okay? So this is why uh, the equal distance channel is more powerful than trend lines because there is the element of symmetry in equal distance channels, unlike trend line, which is just one line on its own, which doesn't have any symmetry, okay? So now that you understand why it's more powerful and uh, you know that symmetry is important in trading, now let's talk about how do you use it, okay? So let me just clear up the charts and uh, let's talk about uh, symmetry. Now this platform I'm using is uh, TradingView. Uh, it's a free platform. Uh, if you do not know how to use this platform, I have another trading video. Okay, but uh, you can find a equal distance channel on any other trading platforms. Okay, it's a very basic tool that uh, you can basically find it anywhere. Okay, so in here, if you want to uh, go on TradingView and you want to use it, you just click on here and you do the parallel channel. Okay. So equidistance channel and parallel channels are the same thing. Okay, the name is uh, kind of interchangeable. So what you want to do is you want to identify two swing highs. Okay, let's say you are trying to project a bottom. Okay, let's say you are trying to project support. Then you want to start from swing highs. Okay, if you want to project resistance, then you want to start from swing lows. Okay, so let me just demonstrate. So in this case, let's assume that we are trying to project uh, support. Now what you do is start with a swing high. And you connect it to another swing high. Okay. Now you'll be prompted to uh in, to to have your lower lower channel, your rather your lower uh trend line. Okay. So what you want to do is you want to drag it down because you're trying to project the support. You want to look for a point, a swing point that's in between these two points. Okay. So you can see over here that uh there is actually a point here. Okay. So I repeat. Step one is uh, you find a swing high, two swing points. Okay, let me just uh, redo this in case uh, you didn't get it. Okay, you do this and you find two relevant swing points, swing high in this case, and then you look for a swing low that is in between these two swing highs, which is actually over here. Okay, and then you bring it down and then you use that to project, uh, project where your potential support is. Okay, so this is how you project support. Now let's talk about the opposite. Okay, the opposite, uh, which is uh, you want to find potential resistance. Uh, it's the same exact thing. Okay, but let me just uh, try to give you another example. Okay, so uh, let's use this example. So same thing as always. You you find a swing low. You find another swing low. You connect it, and then you look for a swing high that is in between uh these two swing lows, which is over here. Okay, it's very important that you find a, a point that is in between these two points, right? So if we shift it down here, you can see that uh, we were able to project uh, this resistance perfectly, right? That means if price was somewhere around here, you would already have known beforehand that this is a strong resistance. You would already have known beforehand that this is a strong resistance, right? So this is the power of a trend, not sorry, not trend line, but equal distance channel, okay? It's very powerful if you use it correctly. Okay, so before I move on to the last point, I want to reiterate one more time the process. Okay, step one is you find a two swing points. Okay, if you are trying to find a resistance, you use two swing lows. Okay, if you are trying to find support, you use two swing highs, and then you you plot it, and then you you drag the uh the line up to a center point of the two uh to a swing low. Uh, sorry, swing high or swing low that is in between the two uh. The two swings, swing low in this case that you have uh, chosen. Okay, so you do it like that. Okay, so hopefully that clears up. Uh, if you need additional help, please leave a comment down below. I'll do my best to address it. If not, we we'll watch this video until you get this concept because it's so powerful. Okay, now let's talk about uh, the last point, which is how do you uh, use it, right? Because now you know how to, uh, you know the power of an uh, equidistance channel. Uh, you know the power of symmetry, right? And you have a step-by-step -step guide to use the equidistance channel. Now let's talk about what are the users, right? 
Okay, number one, you can use the equal distance channel to take profit. Okay, let's assume you entered uh, somewhere here. Okay, and you need a profit target. Uh, this can be a profit target for you. Okay, or it can also be an area where you apply trade management. Right, for example, you know that there's resistance here and you entered here. Right, you might want to shift your stop loss to break even here, or you might want to look for clues that uh, the market is going to reverse over here before making a decision to exit your trade. Right, basically, uh, you kind of know that okay, this is an important level, I'm going to pay attention to it. Okay, the other way that you can use it is you can use it as an entry level. Okay, now before I carry on, I want to make a disclaimer. Okay, the meaning of uh, entry level it's uh, I don't mean to just you know blindly enter here. But I mean, you still need to have a trading system in place. You still need to have a strategy in play uh, when you are trading. Okay? Uh, you don't just want to you know, uh, mindlessly enter the trade without any trading plan. Okay? You want to uh, just have a trading plan that you know works and look for the levels and then you enter accordingly. Okay? If you need a trading plan, uh, our free day trading guide is in the uh, description. Right? You can download a copy of that. That will get you started. Okay, but that's how you use it. You can, uh, you know, look for entries at this level, right? You can look for entries, look for, uh, you know, signs of uh, reversals, follow your trading strategy and execute a trade at these levels as well as, uh, you know, uh, these levels over here. Okay, so that's how you use uh, the equal distance channel, right? For stop loss, right? To, you know, to manage your stop losses, to take profit or to enter a trade, okay? But uh, just reiterate one more time, make sure you use it with a trading strategy that places the odds in your favor. Okay? Do not just blindly uh, enter using an equal distance channel. Okay? That's a very rookie mistake that a lot of new traders uh, make. And I don't want you to watch this video and apply it in the wrong context. Okay? Context is very important. So make sure you understand this point. Okay? So that's it for this video. Right in summary, okay, the equal distance channel is more powerful than trend lines if you are not using it make sure you use okay it's more powerful because it has the element of symmetry okay a step-by-step -step guide uh basically you want to identify swing points right and then uh two swing points and then you shift the uh the other line up into the shift the other up the line up to another swing point that's in between the uh, two swing points you identify and lastly you want to use the equal distance channel uh, for stop loss, take profit as well as entry opportunities. Okay, so that's it for this video. Uh, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And if any questions, just leave a comment down below. And I'll see you in the next video.